guys, it's Jen, and I am coming to you with a car haul. Yay! Everybody applause. Okay, so basically, I just ran out of the house real quickly to get a movie at Redbox, and I figured I would stop at Marshall's. I had to think about where I went. Okay, I was looking for some scented potpourri, because my mom made me some of those, like, homemade, um, I don't know, the right way to pronounce it. Is it sachet or sachet? I'm not quite sure. It's like S-A-C-H-E-T. Like scented little fabric pockets <laughs> or something like that. And I can put them in the linen closet and like in drawers and stuff like that to make everything smell really nice. So I was looking for more potpourri type things. But she bought this really finely milled potpourri, and I'm not able to find it where I'm at. But anyway, so I was able to go to Marshall's and look for that, and then when I couldn't find that, I just decided to walk around the store. Well, that turned out to be really awesome because I found a lot of cute things, and I thought I would do a quick haul for you. Here we go. I don't have a dog, but my brother has two, so I bought them Bark Bars. They're made in the U.S. They're cheddar cheese flavor, and they are natural dog treats. And... I just realized that they are shaped as cats and postmen. That is so hilarious to me. That's what they look like. Yep, I did not even realize that when I picked them up. They are super premium dog treats shaped like cats and postmen. That is cracking me up. So, yeah, those will be delicious, I'm sure. And then I also got these guys chicken breast sweet tater fillets. They're sweet potato, salt, and chicken. Those are the three ingredients. And I thought those would be delicious for them. Okay, and then another thing from my childhood that I've always loved, marzipan and shaped like fruit. I know it's bad for you. I just love it, and I want my little one to try them and just maybe get a taste for it. So I'll have someone else to corrupt. But yeah, so I picked those up. And you know, Marshall's always has all this stuff, and they have tons of aisles, and they have clearance, and oh, Marshall's and TJ Maxx, and then Home Goods. That is the killer. That one is just so nice. There's never a mess. Like Marshall's and TJ Maxx, it's hit or miss, and you've got to like wade through a mess sometimes, but it's totally worth it. Home Goods is just always at least the one near me is always so perfect and coordinated and lovely and then the other snack did I go to Marshall's just to get snacks this is like ridiculous but the other snack I got is bare fruit crunchy cinnamon apple chips 100% organic totally cute yummy can I show you everything okay cool and the last non-food non-dog treat item <laughs> for someone that doesn't have dogs um that I bought is one of the main reasons I went to Marshall's other than um, potpourri. I want to take a page out of Wendy Bentley or Bentley Blonde. I will link her channel below. Uh, a page out of her book. She just did her home tour and I was totally impressed by this little tip that she gave. If the top of a table or like a, um, a console, that, like pretty much what I'm doing, like a dresser type thing, is scratched, put a table runner on it, and it just made it look so beautiful. I know that might seem like, duh, but I know you usually use table runners for like dining room table tables or something. Well, I have a little bit of scratches on a dresser that is right now highlighted because I have a very large TV on it, and it's like, oh, that looks terrible. But now it won't because, look at this runner, guys. It's like <sighs> shimmery gold threaded grassy looking type material I'm so not good at this but I hope the camera's picking it up this is my iPhone I'm sorry but I just wanted to do a quick car haul for you it's beautiful it's by artistic accents is the brand it's 13 inch by 72 inch table runner it's made with 95% water hyacinth so that's impressive um it's also made in Indonesia, and the regular price was, I think, $15, and I got it for 8 An $8 table runner. I'm having a great day. I got marzipan, I've got dog treats, I've got a table runner. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick car haul. I hope everyone is doing well. Um, I'm so out of practice with this because I haven't done a car haul in forever, but I hope you have a wonderful start to your weekend, and take care, and I will be filming this weekend. Yay! Bye, guys!